mindful of the living force, young Padawan. You will be a Jedi. I promise. At last we will reveal ourselves to the Jedi. At last we will have revenge. It's exciting because it's been 20 years of celebration, but also 20 years of the Phantom Menace. It's so surreal to me that Phantom Menace is 20 years old. You have the 20th anniversary of the beginning of the saga, so the Phantom Menace, that's happening this year, and then you have the end of the saga with episode nine coming out, so it's a really great way to celebrate the Skywalker saga. For the episode 9 panel. And I can't wait. I want to see episode 9 trailer. I want to know everything there is to know about this movie. Please welcome our host, Stephen Colbert! Woo! Love Chicago. This is unbelievable to be here. All the other countries around the planet, I want to give you a big wave. How did I find Lando again? Lando it's never amazing. left me. It is my pleasure to introduce the Next Generation cast. Really overwhelming. Hi, hello. BB-8 has a new friend. This is Dio. Who here wants to see a teaser trailer? Again. Sometimes there's endings, and sometimes endings mean new beginnings. We've passed on all we know. A thousand generations live in you now. But this is your fight. I want to ride the Millennium Falcon. I want it. Are you guys excited about finally being able to step into the galaxy of Star Wars? It is beyond your wildest dreams. It'll be surreal, because it looks exactly as we've imagined it would look. Who out here likes Darth Vader? Yes? A Star Wars VR series, Vader, immortal. Oh, God, no! That's not Star Wars on the other side of the screen, but it's like you're in Star Wars. <laughs> Looking forward to some epic lightsaber battles. Kathleen Kennedy, Dave Filoni, and John Favreau! Well, let's start by bringing out Pedro Pascal. <laughs> Gina Carano, Carl Weathers. <laughs> I want you! I want you! When John asked me to come and meet with him about something Star Wars, who do you want me to audition for? He's like, you're the Mandalorian. <laughs> there it is. So we're making the show, and we realized that we didn't have enough stormtroopers. I know a bunch of stormtroopers. We got stormtroopers, got Darth Vader. Some of the ones that are bad, I like. You don't know the power of the dark side. family thing. We all love it together. Everyone around you shares your passion, your interests. It's an environment filled with nothing but positivity. Whoa! The Emperor? What? Everyone's favorite Gungan, Ahmed Best! The father of all creatures, droids, and aliens, Neil Scanlon. Yes, yes, I am very famous, yes. 
It wouldn't be Star Wars without droids, and I'm glad they keep bringing us more and more new droid. I'm a Star Wars droid. This is important. We think he's some sort of god. Oh. <laughs> I can't believe you got that moth-eaten old thing out again. Thank you, Warren. Thank you very much. That's it. Was decided for the exhibitor hall, I think, to buy a lot of stuff. Well, me and my husband and my daughter, we all built Star Wars Legos together all the time. You get to see all the different forms of media, all of the comics and the video games, and that's amazing. Can't wait for Jedi Fallen Order. It seems like it's going to be amazing. This is a Jedi fantasy story game. It's only every kid's dream ever to be a Jedi. feel ready for a Star Wars Rebels panel! Neither one of us is giving up a secret. <laughs> I grew up with Clone Wars, I grew up with Ahsoka, and she's really important to me. To have it come back, they listen, you guys listen, and it just shows how much you care. Isn't this exciting? Everyone's thrilled. I hope so. It's, uh, I hope so, thank you. Many of us never thought this was going to happen. It's beyond thrilling to, to dive back in. We have a wonderful cast reunion here, but I want more. This yeah. is the time that we should show a trailer. You're kidding. The women in Star Wars have always been amazing to me because they were something to aspire to. Women who were strong in their own right, who were capable. My fellow Sisters of the Force, Vanessa Marshall, Amy Ratcliffe, Catherine Tabor, Fina Portillo, and Susie McGrath. I just feel so honored to be here and to be among such fierce human beings on the stage and in the audience. Yeah. It just means the world to see amazing women doing amazing things. Star Wars is my entire existence. It, you can't put it into words how much the whole community means to me and how much I've been able to find friends and family. You're here with all of your friends and you just get to see the creativity and the light in people's eyes. It's one of those things that you know you're going to have to say goodbye to, but it's not going to be goodbye forever. Always be with you.